What up, though? <laughs> Yo, it's your boy G Motor Bro back at it again here at the old jobby job, chilling like Bob Dylan on penicillin, of course. Now, um, I'm just doing this vlog. I'm shooting a vlog because I, you know, I'm talking about this is basically for my wrestling fans, WWE SummerSlam. I said I was going to wait till tomorrow, but why not do it today? Who y'all got? Y'all know the match card. I think we got. Let me see. Uh, I know the kickoff is the Hardys versus... Oh, and Jason Jordan versus the Miz Taraj. Basically a rematch for Monday Night Raw. And we got the Cruiserweight title on the line. <clears throat> Akira to Tozawa. Ha! 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 Versus the King of the Cruiserweights. To see if he can regain his title. Neville. Now, my opinion about the first match, Hardys versus Jason Jordan, I think they're going to win again. Just because the Mr. Raj sucks. That's all. <laughs> That's all. The Mr. Raj sucks. You know what I'm saying? They ain't nobody, you know what I'm saying? Because they got the Miz Intercontinental Champion. To be honest, I think it's robbery. I think it's highway robbery. Being that the Miz is the Intercontinental Champion, he don't get to defend his title tonight. I'm um, tomorrow night. You know, how? How is that possible? Everybody got to defend their title but him. You know what I'm saying? He going to be in a triple threat match. They should put him in another match for the Intercontinental title. But against who? Maybe Miz, maybe, um, maybe Kurt Angle might put it against Jason Jordan. Maybe hook his son up with a title shot. You never know. You never know. <laughs> So I'm, my my money's on um, the Hardys and um, Jason Jordan. I got that match. Um, next match was Akira Tozawa versus Neville. I'm going with Neville. Sorry. I I, I mean he won the first match fair and square, <clears throat> but Neville knows now what to do, now how to play. You see how he played, how he keep it a title. So I think this time he's going to actually win it back. I just got that funny feeling he's going to win that title back. Next, I believe it's AJ Styles versus Kevin Owens for the United States Championship. Rematch after he lost one, lost one. So, you know. <clears throat> so, my predictions with that match, AJ Styles. Sorry, Kev. Kevin Owens is my boy. But uh, I got to go with AJ Styles on this one. Sorry, brother. AJ got my vote on this one. Um, Who's next? Let me think. The Raw Women's Championship? Sasha Banks versus Alexa Bliss. Now, I love me some Sasha Banks. I think she is fine than a mom. Too, too, slim, too skinny for me, but she fine than a mom. You know, no, no. But, um, <laughs> um, Alexa Bliss, I think she gonna pull this one out. I gotta go with Alexa on this one. I just, I just know she, she, she's like wicked. Conniving and stuff. She, she, I think she got this though. I'm sorry. I, 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 sorry, Saj. I love you to death, girl. But I think Alexa going to get this one. Alright. <laughs> Smackdown Tag Team Championship. New Day versus who I call the Thug Usos. Because when they were the Usos, they were, they had the face paint. They come out with the, the little chant. Nah, they, they wear Air Force Ones, Timberland boots, and, and baggy pants. They the thug Usos now. They ain't no Usos no more. No face paint either. And they rhyming when they come to the ring. Thug Usos. That's who I'm going with. Thug Usos. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I mean, I'm sorry. I'm not going with them, but New Day. I I, I got a funny feeling. New Day going to pull it off. I mean, shoot. They was the, raw, not, 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 the longest reigning Raw Tag Champs. So I'm thinking they're going to they're gonna do their thing on um this one. I don't know if they're going to break any records, but they're going to have that title for a minute. I can guarantee you they're going to have that title for a minute. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now the Raw Tag Team Championships. Cesaro and Sheamus versus two-thirds of the former Shield people, Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins. Now you know... I, I'm going for Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins because 
I love this shield. I would love to see a reunion tomorrow night. That would be dope. Imagine that. Imagine that. Right? I'm, I'm, we're going to talk about it. We'll talk about it. They win the tag titles. We're going to ta- we'll talk about that later. All right. Next matchup. Who else is it? Uh, Hold on, guys. I got to see. Uh, I don't know. I don't remember. Oh, Randy Orton versus, versus Rusev. I'm going with Randy. <laughs> sorry. I'm going with Randy. I'm sorry. I got to go with Randy. That's my boy. The Viper. The Legend Killer. Randy Orton. And Naomi versus Natalia for the SmackDown Women's title. Uh, I love Natalia. Don't get me wrong. I love Natalia. I love Natalia since she first started in WWE. And I always thought she she did win the title, but I always thought she'd be, like, dominant. Like, almost like on a Nia Jax level. But um, in this case, I'm going for Natalia. Sorry, Naomi. I think you dope. You win matches. You you can wrestle. You got great skill. But I I I trust Natalia got that. She she just has that 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 oomph. That that mm, a lot of people don't see it now. But I think when she become champion, they're gonna see a lot. Natalia gonna be like, yo. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Natalia gonna be that chick. Word. Um, who next? Hold on, let me see. I don't know all the matches offhand, so I got it on my laptop. Oh, Finn Balor versus John. I'm not sorry, not John C. I mean Bray Wyatt. Now it's gonna be like the 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 devil or the demon versus the demon king. So that's gonna be kind of hard to go with. I mean, I love Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt's my dude. So I mean, he done, him and Finn done got one all up on each other. So. <clears throat> I think I'm going with I'm, I'm going to have to go with Finn Balor on this one Normally I would have said Bray Wyatt But on this one I'm, I'm taking a, a chance with this one And I'm going with Finn I'm going with Finn Balor Good luck to y'all guys Next up is the WWE Championship Jinder Mahal Faces For the first time ever <laughs> Shinsuke Nakamura. Woo. Now, a lot of people know how I feel about Jinder Mahal. I'm glad that he's champion. Because, you know, the 3MB thing, you know, I can tell he didn't really want to do that. I can tell he didn't want to do that, man. They made him do it, you know what I'm saying? So, I know he was like, man, whatever. So, when he got let go, he probably was like, you know what, whatever. I ain't want to do that shit no more anyway. You know what I'm saying? So, now he back. The modern day Maharaja. I'm going with the modern day Maharaja on this match, y'all. I like Shinsuke Nakamura. I've seen him wrestling Pro Japan, New Japan, New Pro, New Japan Pro Wrestling. I've seen him wrestle overseas and everything else, but it's just I got I got with gender. And that's not because he got the Singh brothers either. That's not because he he rolled with the Singh brothers. I think without the Singh brothers, he'll beat Shinsuke. To be honest. Or Great Kali. Hopefully none of them interrupt and we get a good match. And we get a fair match to see who's better. Now, if Shinsuke was going against... I mean, if if, if uh, Jinder was going against John Cena, everybody knows John Cena would have won that. I know John Cena would have won. So, I'm going with Jinder. And now, the last and final match, the main event. The Fatal 4-Way for the Universal Championship. And Brock got a stack against him with Braun Strowman, Roman Reigns, and Samoa Joe. Man, that's going to be an epic. That is a way to end SummerSlam. However, they could actually end it even better. <laughs> like I was saying, I was going to mention at the end of this uh, tour when I got to this match. Now, I mentioned about Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins. Winning the tag championship. Now, you know, a fade forward is no disqualification, right? What if? I know it might not happen, but what if? Just, just imagine. Just think one second. What if the Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins come down, help Roman Reigns win the Universal title, 
and they do the full fist bump. Boy, that's going to go crazy. The crowd go crazy. Yo, I guarantee you, I guarantee you, if Roman Reigns get back with the Shield, they're going to stop hating on him. They're going to stop hating him. He might be the champ, but they're going to stop hating him. Think about it. They're going to stop hating him. They're going to stop hating him because I'm going to tell you, uh, what was that? I think Survivor Series last year when they had Team SmackDown versus Team Raw. And with uh, uh, Dean Ambrose went after his own boy, went after AJ Styles before the brand split. Oh, no, no, I mean, sorry, it was the brand split. Sorry, before they got traded to Raw, before Dean got traded to Raw. And and, and when uh, Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns helped Dean Ambrose with the security, crowd went freaking nuts. Nobody was booming Roman at that time. The boys, oh, boom, boom, and boom. No, they was happy. That everybody was ecstatic when that happened. So I can imagine, I can imagine if that was to happen. Yo, if that happened tomorrow night, yo, I'm going to be going crazy. I'm going to be at this motherfucking job. Excuse my language. I'm going to be at this job going ape crap. For real, I'm going to be going crazy. Like, oh, snap. Oh my god. Yeah, you know I'm gonna do a video too. You know I'm gonna do a video on that, yo. I swear to goodness I'm doing a video. But uh yo guys, I'm gonna let y'all go, man. I done took up enough of y'all time. I right, y'all thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. Tell your friends about me, tell your boys, tell your girls, tell your parents, everybody you can tell. To holla at your boy. If you like watch WWE Champions, check, uh, um, subscribe to my channel. I play that game like mostly every day. I play that game every day. And now I had uh, uh, looked on YouTube to find out how I can record. So I've been recording, uploading videos of gameplay to that. So when 2K18 come out, I just got to figure out how to hook up my Xbox so I could record and um, upload it to YouTube. So guys... Thank you again for watching. I love y'all. Take it easy this Saturday night. You know, it's beautiful out. Oh, depending on where you live, it's beautiful. Where I live, it's, it's gorgeous. Wish I didn't have to sit up in here, but somebody got to get this money. <laughs> so until next time, guys, Big G Motor Bro, deuces.